All right, time to play some H3 VR. Hopefully this is all recording because I'll be wasting my time if it's not. Looks like it is. Okay, cool. Well, we got a new update today and uh, well, let's get right to it. It's going to be a pretty short one because uh, it's uh, mostly just, I think Anton's just working on back end stuff, uh, fixing bugs and all that. But we did get a couple of new toys. Well, one of them is a new toy. Uh, one of them was uh, uh, kind of in the game, but not really accessible. But We'll get to that when we get to that. All right, first up, let's check out the new toy, which is the Mammoth, which is from the game Proteus, which is, uh, I think is out of early access now. So, yeah. Uh, this, uh, if I remember correctly, this is uh, a backer, backer tier weapon. Uh, I think Anton was a backer for the game, so he got to design uh, a weapon, and this is it. Pretty cool. Wow, look at that. Just want to look at that in the light. Nice little, uh, nice little design there. Very um, hellish, I guess that's the word you want to say. I like how the uh, things, uh, the little, uh, little uh, accents there, uh, whatever they're called, they're floating. Yeah, the uh, front side is floating as well. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that is a really cool looking gun. So, all right, let's go through the controls. Uh, so this is a revolver, uh, single action, if I remember correctly. And it shoots uh, 0.666. Uh, let me check out the bullet here. Chaos, I think that's what it's called. Uh, we can check it in here. I'll type. Yep. Infernal. All right. There you go. Real, <laughs> real unique looking round there. Pick that on there. All right. But uh, controls. All right. So left on the touchpad breaks it open. Down on the touchpad pulls the hammer back. Of course, you can, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, pull the trigger. Uh, right on the touchpad gives you an alternate mag, or sorry, alternate gun pose, so you can reload it easier, which I don't think is really needed. Oh, uh, we'll talk about this later. Uh, let's see. Options panel. Uh, let's see. Firearms. No. Let me see. Yeah, I don't think we need the alternate uh, gun pose, because yeah, this thing is so large, uh, when you put the bullets in, or the uh, speed loader, which we'll get to in a minute, it's not really, uh, it's not really hitting anything, as you can see by my Vive controllers there. <laughs> so, I mean, you can have an alternate uh, gun pose, if you need, to reload for other controllers, but for the Vive ones, yeah, pretty much you don't really need it. But that's, uh, yeah, that's uh, right on the touchpad. And of course... I think up spins the gun, as usual with uh, as usual with all revolvers. So, yeah, it's just funny how the, there's a alternate uh, controller pose, <laughs> but the gun is so massive you don't really need it. But it's a welcome uh, addition. So, all right, so let's check out the speed loader. This is the speed loader, which is yeah the mammoth mammoth speed loader. Pretty cool. Holds about six rounds. And uh, you know what? Let us hide the controller geo because we don't need to uh, see this. All right. Let's actually fire this thing. Uh, okay. Got the target all set up and ready to go. We got our gun here. And again, you don't really need to alternate controller pose. Since the gun is so large. Oh, wait. Single action. Completely forgot. You got to cock the hammer back. And of course, uh... 
I think Anton showed this in the devlog, but you can uh, fan the uh, revolver, which is uh, a <laughs> little, uh, little out of control there because this thing fires a large caliber. There you go, that's pretty cool. Let me just uh, go fire a couple more times. Let's reset the target. I like how the um, bone, I guess you want to call it a bone. This is bone, this is bone, right? <laughs> I like how the bone gets like red hot when you fire the gun. Watch. Let's look at that from a uh, different angle here. Yeah, see, it gets, it gets like, got that magical energy. Just the sounds, too. Reloading the, when you insert the uh, speed loader in there. Oops. Oh, you can spin the uh, barrel too. You have to do that. Oh, <laughs> all right, whatever, whatever. Just wanted to do a little Russian roulette there. One more time. Oh, oh yeah, you can see the bullet. <laughs> but yeah, there's the, that's the uh, Mammoth. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Let me just get one more bullet here. And it is pretty cool. Wow, look at that detail on the front, too. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of weird looking down the... Uh, well, there is no real barrel to this gun. But, uh, yeah, just looking at all the details there. This is a really, really nice model. Very fictional, but still pretty cool. All right, oops. I am, uh, need to move to the center of my play space here. Wait, hold on. Where is the center? There we go. Okay. Moving right along. Oops. Let's just uh, get rid of these for right now. The other toy that we're going to take a look at today is, uh, well, it's been in the game for a while. Well, it's ever since the alpha, the uh, experimental builds have come out. But it's just not accessible it wasn't accessible until now so now we've got the m 1912 oh 1950 51 sorry i get that confused 1951 which is uh yeah pretty cool little pistol i think anton showed it off in one of the other devlogs but uh we got our first uh first chance to use it although uh if i remember reading correctly somebody uh managed to get this during a take and hold run which uh, if I if I had played Taken Hold, maybe I would have gotten it, but I just didn't have any time. But uh, anyways, so yeah, let's look at it in the light here. Ooh, nice and shiny, very nice. Of course, fires nine millimeter, and yeah. All right, we got a safety, so okay. And put the safety on. Oh, well, the safety would work, but oh, there we go. Okay, now it's safe. And then we just turn the safety off. Oh, it's got a. Uh, it's all. It's also a decocker. So, put the safety off right here. Right. 
Press the safety on. Which is thumb pad up, by the way. So, <laughs> I'm forgetting to uh, mention that. Got a slide lock, which uh, we'll see if it works. But, uh, yep, that's uh, swipe up, uh, down from 6 o'clock to 9, I think. Yeah, something like that. Down to down to left. And then left uh, releases it. And we'll get our magazine here. Nice little magazine. And we are ready to shoot. Okay. All right. Works uh, just as intended. Although uh, I'm not too familiar with this uh, model of pistol. So if there are any inaccuracies, I might not know. But uh, yeah. Accurate. Not too bad a sight picture. Although I am holding it a little closer to my uh, my eyes. Yeah, it seems okay when uh, held at normal arm's distance. Yeah, there you go, the M1951. Pretty cool. Let's uh, get a good look of it firing. All right, well, those are the two, oh, those are the two toys that were added. Or, well, one of them was newly added, the other one was just in the game but couldn't be accessed. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. The final thing that we're looking at today is this. Yeah, you saw it earlier uh, when I was trying to spawn the options menu there. But this is the new item. Uh, this is the new wrist menu. And uh, yeah, it's a lot more uh, smaller, compact. Very, uh, I guess, uh, efficient. Uh, is that a good word to describe this? I think, well, that's what, that's what I would say. But yeah, it's, uh, you know, it's there. And uh, it's, you know, one of the things is that um, you can open up the menu and then, you know, if you move your hand away, oh, I got to go back and, you know, whatever. So the menu stays open. But you got uh, spawn tools, cleanups, and stuff. Empty mags. Uh, no, that's, let's not do that right now. Uh, this one's disabled. I don't know what these are. So uh, we'll have to see. But then... Uh, Oh, that's right. These are for the, um, you know what? Oh, wait a minute. I think we've run into a bug. Uh, I can't exit to the menu. Anton, please help. Okay, that's a bug. I guess we're stuck here. <laughs> Until I reload the game. Oh, uh, no. Can you hear that? Clicking my triggers. Nothing's working. Hmm. Okay, those work. Obviously, that worked. Yep. Yep, got the spectator panel. Yeah, this this one uh, doesn't seem to work, so this is going to be really... I wanted to move to another scene. But, yeah, I think these buttons are for um, Game Planner. So, I think he showed it off in the video. Um... The save load uh, panel is, I think, over here. <laughs> yeah, I would probably go to another scene if I could. All right, that that's uh, that's a major bug that we that uh, somebody will need to send to Anton. Uh, not right now because I've got to record this video. But uh, yes, that is a very major bug. I cannot seem to exit out of the out of the scene. Well. <sighs> Yeah, but uh, you know it's it's still pretty cool. I like it. It's it's smaller. Doesn't uh, I think it used to be like this long, right? About uh, about a little longer than the controller itself. But now it's all compact, and you can call up whatever you need and call it back. It's got a uh, you know it's still got the clock there, which is pretty nice. But uh, other than that, I mean, it's just a pretty uh, pretty streamlined uh, wrist menu. So, 
Yeah. All right. Well, since I'm stuck here, uh, what am I going to do for my last thing? I was going to go and check out uh, the say load stuff, which, yeah, I, I, if I remember correctly, it doesn't quite work, but it's, you know, you would have been able to uh, take a look at that. But, uh, yeah, so I guess I'm stuck here. At least we got the uh, Mammoth. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Hold on. So if you don't grab the gun, the little uh, little bone accents, you know, kind of just go in. But as soon as you grab it, it kind of activates. <laughs> that's pretty cool. I didn't notice that before. Just got to spin the gun like that. All right, well. Well, I'm stuck here. Uh, well, you know, all, all things considered, it's not really a bad place to get stuck in. A firing range with uh, unlimited access to uh, firearms. So I'm going to check out one thing before I go. Let's, uh... Hmm. I wonder if I can do something here. I wonder if it's possible. Tactical? No, no, it's not going to work. Um, Magfed. Also, I think there's a hair in my, um... Hmm. Hmm. Don't really know if I want to do uh, what I want to do. You know what? I'm going to do I'm going to build something. Let's build something. Let's build um let's take a look at these uh, <clears throat> uh let's see. Hmm. Let's grab ourselves a Mark 18. Uh, let's grab a regular stand egg. Okay. Um, no, I don't need a foregrip because I'm going to do something. Back to categories. Let's grab ourselves a underbarrel M870. Grab this. Let's stick this in here. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. What else do I need? Suppressor. Let's grab a suppressor. Let's grab the. Um, where is the true fire? Here we go. Grab this. Okay. Right, grab that shotgun shell because we might need it. All right, let's see what else. Get some scopes. Let's get the ER4. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe the ham combo scope. Okay. Right, and then laser. Let's see. Stick that. Hmm, no. Go forward. No, it's kind of blocking, so let's. Uh, Put it on the other side here. And then what can I what, what can I put here? Tactical flashlight? No, no, no. Get that flashlight. Alright, cool. Okay, what else can I put on this thing? Rail adapter? No, no. Let's get a decorative. Get ourselves a long as the rail cover. Is this pretty long? Oh, yeah, that'll work. Okay. And then we'll get ourselves a medium. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, that's right. I can't save this. <laughs> I was going to save this. Uh, that's all right. All right, cool. I need to load up this shotgun, so let's go one, two, three, four, uh, yeah, four. Six, right? I, just, I did a ghost load there. Okay. Get rid of those. Okay, cool. There we go. Eh, that'll be good enough. Extend the stock. Let's move this to... 10 meters. Five meters. Let's go to two meters. Wait, hold on. hurting. Whoops. Oh, no. I got a problem with my hands. I need to get that checked out. But yeah, there we go. <laughs> I just had to do that for some reason. Build my, uh, build a gun. Although, I don't think, uh, like I said, I don't think the save load feature works. Yeah, so, yeah, it's disabled. But, uh, if I were able to save it, I would have saved that. But, Anyways, that's about it for today. Very short uh, little update. And, uh, yeah. I will see you guys. Next time.